Ohio State University President Michael V. Drake and students visited Northwest Ohio for this year's state tour. Their first stop, the Red Pig Inn in Ottawa, where President Drake surprised students, alumni, and supporters from Putnam County. Oh, what's your name? Maddie. Maddie, nice to meet you, Maddie. Students on the Buckeye bus were grateful for the experience. So the state tour, um, our specific part of it is called the Buckeye bus. It is with the Office of Student Life. So we follow President Drake's state tour um, around Ohio. And our goal is just to interact with the state, um, really spread Buckeye love because we're so focused on Columbus and everything we do on our campus. So state tour is really an opportunity to go out into the communities, go to local businesses, do service projects, and reach out with alumni to really show that we appreciate them and all they do for Ohio State and really see what makes up the state of Ohio. Hey, hey. What you're going to see is we deal with a lot of raw vegetables, raw ingredients coming right out of the fields of Ohio. The next stop was the Campbell Soup Supply Company plant in Napoleon, Ohio, which is the company's largest U.S. manufacturing location. From there, they got a behind-the-scenes look at what goes on at Ohio State's Agricultural Research and Development Center in Fremont. And our goal here is to test to see if this mycorrhizal fungus will make that plant even hardier and healthier. It's been honestly very eye-opening. I. I'm not originally from Ohio, so I came straight from home, straight to Columbus, and I haven't seen what the rest of Ohio looks like. But to really interact with the communities around me, it's been totally life-changing. I think I had a severe lack of appreciation for how much they really do for us, and especially going to like the Agricultural Research Station and going to the various companies that do sponsor us. I think it was really cool to like figure out what goes on behind the scenes and like what makes us who we truly are. We are uh, now beginning the celebration of our sesquicentennial something that we've been thinking uh, about for about 149 and a half years, and, and now here we are uh, so quick. President Drake kicked off Ohio State's sesquicentennial at the Rutherford B. Hayes Presidential Library and Museums. He reminded the audience of the importance of the university's land-grant mission. We've stayed true to that mission of being able to be a place where the sons and daughters of the people of our community could be educated in ways that would allow us to advance the community forward. The trip also included a service project at Mercy Health Tiffin Hospital in Seneca County. I think it's an amazing opportunity for students not only to interact with students outside of your typical groups, your clubs, and your majors, then you get to interact with other Ohio State faculty um, from agronomists in Northwest Ohio to the president's you know, um, employees. And then you also get to you know, meet so many amazing Ohio State alumni which is great, but then also you get to meet people of the communities of Ohio, and you get to make connections that you probably would never, you know, you would never make if you didn't go on this bus. First of all, you, you probably don't know, but we have uh, today 350 employees from Ohio State here at our campus. 24 miles away from Mercy Health, the group, along with Brutus, were able to make more connections with those at the corporate headquarters of Marathon Petroleum. <laughs> Headquartered in Findlay, Ohio, Marathon Petroleum Corporation is one of the largest petroleum product refiners, marketers, and distributors in the United States. Wow, it's a party. Oh my, can you get your Buckeye stuff? Last, but certainly not least, they stopped for a sweet treat at Jersey Drive-In Ice Cream Shop. Hi. Nice to meet you. Aubrey Watkins, a current member of the Ohio State University Marching Band, is an employee of Jersey and says the tour was a cool experience. Tastes okay? Chocolate and peanuts, right, 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 okay, right. For any student that is given this opportunity, I say take it. Take it and be extremely open-minded about it because you're going to walk away with so many different learning experiences, especially myself. I came in here thinking, you know, I don't really know what's going on. I kind of just got invited on this bus tour. I get to meet President Drake. Like, it's going to be a cool experience. But now I've met some of the coolest people. I've met students from the Spear Squad. I've met, I got to meet, like, the drum major. I get to meet students that are doing all sorts of neat things. And we all exist in the same space, but we don't even really know of each other. The next state tour is in August, and maybe, just maybe, we'll be coming to your city. I'm Ben Johnson for Ohio State News.